How about the whole... Did you hear about the changes they're making to Twitch? Yeah, there are some interesting developments supposedly uh, coming to Twitch. According to a report from Bloomberg, Twitch is kicking around some big ideas with how they monetize the platform, which has caused a, a lot of... Um, you know, a disturbance in the force, if you will. One of which is for the highest paid streamers, those who have a 70-30 revenue split with Twitch. If, so, for example, if a streamer gets a dollar through a sub, the streamer would get 70 cents and the Twitch would get 30. For most streamers, it's 50-50. And they are toying around with the idea of reducing the revenue split for streamers, for the highest tiered streamers, down to 50-50. And that is such a gut punch to the, like, pretty much everybody on Twitch. The idea that you were making this much before, and, like, everyone's been fighting for higher. Like, you know, 50-50 and, you know, 70-30 is, 70-30 is, like, still not great. Like, if anything, it the, the argument should be everyone should be up to at least 70-30. And instead, Twitch is like, no, the, the, the our, our most, our best streamers who bring in the most money, we're giving you a cut. And it's not just like 70 to 30. When you think about like actual revenue, it's actually like a 30% decrease in revenue. If this is your job, imagine that, right? W regardless of how much you're making, imagine your boss said, hey, you're going to get paid, you're going to do the exact same job, and you're going to make 30% less money doing that same thing. How would you feel? It's it's absolutely miserable uh, for, for, the, for, for Twitch to, to do that to its creators, <laughs> uh, especially the ones who are literally bringing millions of dollars to the platform and are the biggest draws for, for why this whole thing exists. And I mean, there's bigger ramifications to this as well. The, the fact that Twitch is looking into, you know, trying to incentivize more ads, which is like, I don't necessarily hate the idea of Twitch monetizing this platform, but not in ways that hurt the content. And I'm not saying don't have ads period, but they like some of the ad stuff that they have is just like awful. The pre-rolls, um, mid rolls don't really make sense in a live streaming medium. And like, I don't know what incentives they can provide that, that don't hurt the content as much. I actually kind of like the one, like the banner that, that kind of shrinks the window. And then you see the banner for the, I think that's fine. I would be more okay with stuff like that than just dropping an ad in the middle of me doing this rant right now and then you just can't hear me while it's playing an ad for i don't know pringles or something uh brutal stuff and so that was one of the things was there anything else i was missing it was the it was the split it was more ads um and i can't remember the other part if there was another part but it, it goes to show yet again that if you want to succeed as a if you want to make content creation your career uh, don't put your eggs all in one basket it doesn't matter if it's twitch doesn't matter if it's youtube doesn't matter if it's snap ugh, snapchat doesn't matter if it's only fans doesn't matter if it's vine <laughs> um it doesn't matter what what these platforms are they are not sustainable enough for for any creator to to bank their entire living on that platform twitch could change the revenue split and all of a sudden you're losing 30 percent of your pay uh mixer could go out of business and you've lost your entire career uh youtube adpocalypse can happen and all of a sudden you're not making money anymore or youtube can change the algorithm like they did years ago and and then all of a sudden your content doesn't generate money anymore. W whatever the case may be, if you if you really want to take content creation seriously and, and grow your presence and, and make this a, a revenue generating thing, 
make sure you have a presence on as many platforms as you can. Start up your YouTube, start up your TikTok, your Instagram, your OnlyFans, your Fansleys, your whatever it is. Whatever it is, make sure you've got as many, your footprint on as many places as you can so that you don't get burned by stuff like this.